Hi, welcome to this tutorial. We've uh, found an old Samsung NC10 uh, NC10 Samsung netbook, and as you can see, I've popped in already a USB with a 32 bits of Linux Mint Mate. We can see it somewhere. I thought, let's open it up. So not yet, but uh, the intro was for Mate. So you could install any other distribution as well like Cinnamon XFCE but we're gonna try Mate since I hope that that uh, will not consume so much uh, power I'm not gonna connect to internet for now so I'm gonna skip this and um, well it's one gigabyte of RAM so it's not uh, much uh, we'll definitely need to use a swap uh, a partition to be able to work comfortably and I popped out the original hard disk and I put in the SSD so I hope that that uh, will also give me the feeling of a fast machine so we're actually talking about a netbook of 8 years old or even more um, we're well, not in New York my dear friend but of course without any information via the net you can't know Berlin is not the place either let's give it another try otherwise I'll set it later I'll set it later we are in uh, Antwerp Belgium so I would have picked Brussels so now he wants to go to France with me <laughs> that's the consequence uh, let's go up to Belgium where is it Belgian and that's an Azerti keyboard for us we've grown up using that so it's rather difficult to for us to change now to QWERTY so as you can see it's an NC10 that confirms it thank you and now I'm trying to type hold it with one hand and type with another not that easy and login automatically continue and then uh, the next uh, a tutorial will be of course uh, showing you how it is uh, performing that's the most important test how is Linux Mint 18.1 32 bits mate uh, working on a Samsung NC10 with SSD rather than a normal hard disk and no extra gigabytes of RAM just one I might be able to pop in one of two gigabytes but I have to invest I think about 30 euros not sure if I'm gonna do it, but let's do it this uh, test first.